guys. My name is Rajit Karki and I'll be the instructor for this course. So in this course, we are going to make a complete job web portal using the Laravel as a backend technology and Vue.js as a front-end technology. And this is the demo of our project that we are going to build throughout this course. So you can see the list of jobs in the front page. Along with you can see the login and employer and seeker registration. And if you scroll down, you can see list of company that are associated with this job portal. So if you click one of this link, you'll go to the detail of the jobs. And here you can read the details about job. And here you have a short information about the company who has posted this job. Here you can see the employee type, last date to apply, address, and here you can see the company name with the link. So if you click the company name, you'll go to the company page. Here you can see the company cover photo, logo, description of our company, name of the company, slogan, phone number, website, and everything. And here you can see this particular company has posted three jobs. And if you again click the job, you'll go to that particular job description. At the moment, I'm not logging, so I cannot apply for this job, neither I can save this job. So another feature here is our autocomplete source using the views. Yes. So as soon as you start to type the keyword, it suggests you the list of jobs that matched with your keyword. So it is implemented with the Vue.js. So if you click, you will again go to the detail page. So let me log in as a seeker, job seeker. And as a login, I come to the home page. And here you can see the list of jobs that I have saved it. And I can read it and I can apply it later whenever I want. So here I have already saved a job. And now I can save or unsave the job. Now if I go and click any of these jobs now I can apply for that jobs so if I apply my application will be sent for that particular jobs here is another link with the profile link here I can update my profile I can update my profile picture I can update my cover letter I can update my resume and so on so this is all about seeker that he can do when he is able to log in. So let's look about the employer part. Here in the front page, we have faced the 10 jobs, but you can also browse all the jobs by clicking the browse all buttons. And here you can see the filters. So you can filter the jobs according to your requirement and you can choose jobs that you want to apply for. Use this system as a seeker or employer. You need to register first. And once you register as an employer seeker, a verification link will be sent to your mailbox. And once you verify your email, you will be able to log in and access the system. So once I logged in as a employer, I can see this page. And here I can update my company logo. I can update all the details related to my company. I can update the cover photo of the, my company and I can do everything you can see here in my page. Here I can view the company page as well. And here is the my jobs. These are the jobs that I posted in this application. So here I can read the jobs. I can edit the jobs. Currently you can see how I posted two jobs through my company. And here I can edit the jobs. And I can update these jobs. Similarly, you can see the applicants link. And this is, is one of the, my particular jobs that I have posted in this application. And here I got the one job seeker who has applied to this particular job. This is the profile picture of that applicant and these are the details of that applicant. Here I can download his resume and cover letter. And here is a post a job link. Here I can post a job. Okay. And once this job has been posted, once this all the form is filled, the job will be displayed in the front page in only one condition if the employer choose this as a live instead of dry. So I try to cover everything in this course. Starting from the scratch, first of all, we'll learn about the installation. We'll make all the necessary things in order to get a start with the project. And then we'll cover the, some of the Laravel fundamentals. We'll be learning about the routing, introduction to form, how to get an input. We'll be learning about how to make a migration and seeder file. 
after that we'll cover the important features of larvae with the relationship and after learning all these fundamentals we'll be making a simple crowd application using the larvae so by making this application you will get a much more knowledge about the larvae and you'll be ready to make a big project which is the making a complete job portal using the larvae and Vue.js. so i try to cover every part of the larvae and if you think if i have me missed some of the part then never hesitate to ask me in the QA section, I'll be happy to help you. So I really hope to see you in this course.